Yeah, the clock has disappeared, so if there's any kind of time challenge that I had a chance for, I've lost it. Bonus hearts! Aw, oh, babies. These things tentatively teleport, and they can telefrag you. Which basically means they teleport right on top of you, which is something you can't do anything about. Alright, and I healed a bit. I'm killing those, so I get this. Actually, that might have been wasted, because I might have had full health from getting a health boost. for a bomb? You betcha! Actually, if I'd put that a little bit closer, I might have been able to hit both rocks with one bomb. Oh well. Onwards! Now, you see, there's a room... There's a space in the room to the right of here, like down. Down from here, there's a space. There's a pot valid potential location for a secret room. If there is no hole or gap or pit. Yeah, a pit like this, if there's no pit on the left side of the room down and to the right, there might be a secret room here, and I'll bomb it. Oh, these ones have eyeballs. I guess that means that they go faster. Yes, that does indeed mean that they go faster. But I have penetrating tears that push them back multiple times. I think I have to bomb this door to get it open, but I've got 12 bombs, so who cares? It takes more than one. And there is no pit here. Does this heal me if I use it? Let's find out. Sounds like it healed me. Yep, it healed me. Alright, so let's bomb that wall open. Secret room! Ooh, and a bomb chest. I can take care of that. Let's see if I can't push it up here. Position it a little bit better for myself. This has to be opened with a bomb. So let's bomb not only the mushrooms, which typically have lots of stuff in them, but the, the stone person and the chest. Ooh, pills. Tears down. Aw, I did not need that. Go Ted, he accepts your offering. I don't know what that means. Ooh, five. Send up, I guess. I wonder if that thing would have been dead if I hadn't gotten tears down from my random... Possibly. More money, please! Oh, God, the blood bag is so nice. Right, so they only charge me when I'm directly in line with them? Not so bad. Getting it kind of close there. I really don't like that they're splitting blood all over my floor. That's actually more dangerous than they themselves are. Because I'm a dumbass and I will step on it. Despite the fact that it's a perfectly visible thing that you can avoid. No, come back here. Look, I'm in line with you. I don't have enough range to follow him. See, I'm trying to keep an eye out for any soul rocks. And a coin. No immediately visible soul rocks, and it's not like I get to actually get to one anyway. Okay, this is a slightly dangerous one. Oh, right, I'm running up against him. Yeah, so red fires, they shoot blood at you them out. Which you should put out fires anyway, because as you can see, fires sometimes spit out nice things. Usually bunny. Usually just bunny. Well, you're not at all dangerous at all. You are in fact completely undangerous.
Pheromones. Don't know what that does. Maybe I should have picked that up later. Hello! Oh, penetrate. Okay, so those those skull things, those laughing things, those are completely immune to all damage and float around the room until you kill every enemy in the room that can be killed. Then they die. See if I can't get two of them to fire down so that I'm safe to go. Yeah, these penetrating tears are the bomb. I don't think I can use my blood bag anymore without risking losing the internal heart. Chariot again. Alright, now I've got the map. Doesn't it tell me where the boss room is? Maybe it's down the end of this hall. Let's hope so. Hey, a chest behind. Hey, a bunch of rocks, and I've got a bunch of bombs. This is gonna be profitable. I also got six keys. Ooh. You know what? I don't need rage. That's not coming off, and it regenerates me. Slowly. Very, very slow. Now, these things are normally invulnerable from the front, but I've got penetrating tears, so I can hit them at all times, which is super, super nice. Alright, let's fight that boss. It's mom. I wonder if this would do more damage if I had more speed, movement speed. I really wish I could be using the blood bag. Oh, the, the, the black heart will actually protect me. It's good. I'm pretty sure that my blood bag still, since it takes off directly off of red hearts, won't survive if I use the blood bag. I have to finish her. If I take another hit, I'm going to be risking the eternal heart. Ah, I man, I'm risking the eternal heart. No, no, no. Oh, lost eternal heart and to the least, the least dangerous part of the fight. Oh, what is that? What is this? Damage and range. I will take that. So much money. Alright, let's see what's in the room full of sin. Maybe that's what the goat head did. Guarantee me a room? Ooh. Blood clot is doing that. Okay. Uh, I don't know what that blue minion does, and I don't want to find out. Wealth, but at what cost? Contract. I don't know what this is actually doing for me. I haven't got a clue. Oh! Oh, lovely! Mom seals you in. I forgot about that, so I'll have to keep that in mind. On to the next level. Would have liked to have finished the rest of the levels. Probably shouldn't have taken the Eternal Heart, too. Alright. Challenge room to the right. I've got plenty of damage. Let's go check it out. I don't know what this does, so I'm not going to use it. Until after I've cleared the room. Oh, you guys are going to be wrecked so hard by my penetrating gears. And you're going to be wrecked even harder! Oh, but you might actually hit me because I'm a dumbass. That's odd. I seem to have taken a full heart off instead of half. Okay, I accidentally checked it once. Two monstros! Which is actually kind of dangerous. They do that! That could've... Oh dear, I died. And that's that run. 
That'll be the end of this episode. Y'all have a great day. I'll see you next time. This is actually super fun. I'm glad I came up with this idea. Bye-bye.